Hi, Becky Spieth here. I'm so excited to be with you again this Saturday. So thanks so much for spending time with me. I know it's really important that you have time with your family and that you take just a few minutes to spend with me. It means a lot. I wanna to talk to you a little bit today about what I love when I work with my coaching clients. One of the things that you can do for your team as well is to make sure that you're really empowering them. Empowerment is one of the greatest things that you can do for your team. You can hold their belief for them when they may not even have any belief themselves. This is a great exercise to kind of do an inventory of what you've been doing with your team as well. So let me ask you, when's the last time you let those people on your team, you know, the ones that are, are more of like what we would consider the D personality, the ones that are more driven and, and they're, they're always wanting to conquer and, and really the go-getters. When's the last time you told them, you know what, way to go. I'm so proud of you. Great job. You know, you are so on fire and really let them know how much you respect what they do. That's going to mean a lot to them. What about those people that are your socializers, the ones that are just always the life of the party? When's the last time you took just a few minutes to let them know how special they were, that they did an outstanding job, that they did tremendous, that they made your day and that you think they're incredible? These are awesome things that you can do for those people on your team that, that you know, they're always moving from one thing to the next. They're all excited and, and they really want to make a difference with people. Speaking of that, what about the, the people on your team that are more of the S personality or, or the, the type of personality where they always just want to help support people and, and be there for other people? When's the last time you took just a few minutes to tell them how much they meant to you? Maybe write them a handwritten note, send them a fun text with an emoji that says, you know what, you mean the world to me. You're special. Thank you for everything you're doing. Thanks for being consistent. Those are really important words for them. And what about those personalities, you know, the ones that are a little more calculating and, and precise and exact? When's the last time you just let them know how much you valued their opinion? How the important they were to you and that they got everything right and they didn't only get it right, they did it perfectly. If you want to make a big difference with your team, it's important that you affirm them. It's important that you empower them. And it's really important that you take the time to work on developing your relationship with them. I hope that you have a fantastic week and, and I'll be with you again next week. Um, also wanted to remind you, don't forget to forward this to your friends. Mark below the people that you've contacted on your team and the difference it made for them. Uh, trust me, if you take just a minute to reach out to them, it'll make a world of difference. And then also we've got some incredible promotions going on and things like that. So always check back at the website or go to my Facebook pages, The Christian Direct Seller or Direct Sales Specialist. And then check out the newsletter. I know we've got some exciting things coming up that you're not going to want to miss. Thanks for being with me. Thanks for allowing me to be a part of your journey and know how much I truly, truly appreciate you. I'll be with you again next Saturday. So take care. God bless you. And I'll see you real soon.